Hi guys, Quan Smith here, and welcome back to a new video. Today I'll be doing a um, figure review, um, merchandise review of um, the stuff I bought today from Spin and Height, Bristol. Um, I bought a couple things. Overall, I spent thirty pounds there, um, twenty pounds on the amazing Daleks you see before me, and then ten pounds on some fifty pound Vasu micro figures. So, to start off this review. I'll start with the micro figures. So, um, I'll put them in the order that I. Um, Patent, um, um, open them in because I was going to do an unboxing, but well, and an opening, but it was too um difficult with the packaging and the camera kept falling over as it does always. So I thought this would be a lot easier, a lot quicker, and a lot less time consuming. So I'll show you the figures now in the order that I unbox them. So I got the Tenth Doctor, played by David Tennant. The Fifth Doctor, played by Peter Davidson. The Eleventh Doctor, played by Matt Smith. The Fourth Doctor, played by Tom Baker. And the Eighth Doctor, played by Paul McGann. Some of my all-time favourite Doctors here. And um, some of my favourite designs. I particularly like David's, Tom's and Paul's design. Although I do like Peter and Matt as well. So I'll quickly show them to you. David was on Sonic Scooter. So this is in his long coat. In various episodes. In the trench coat. The original was in his blue suit. This is his brown suit. And it looks really nice figure actually. Um, it's done very well I think. So I like this figure very much. Um, Peter Davidson in his I think it's season 19 outfit maybe. Um, it's got the stripes there and the uh, different colour trousers. No, no, this is, no, this is his um, generation outfit. So this is, isn't season 19. It's later on. Season 21 or something. Um, and it's really nice actually. I do like this. This is what you're generating in the case of Antonia. It's a really nice figure. Um, I do like it. Um, now Matt Smith from Rebel Flash and the Almost People is blue shirt and blue bow tie. It's quite nice. It's pretty much the same as um, the older version, only with blue bow tie and blue shirt. But it is very nice and I'm glad they included it. Um, so yeah. This is quite nice. Then Tom Baker, this is out the lot. Maybe apart from Tennant, this is my favourite. You've got the iconic scarf here. And this is his season 18 outfit. And also his regeneration outfit. So you can easily make a Davidson regeneration figure with this. It is a really nice figure and I do like it. And then Paul McGann uh, from, the, um, from the Doctor Who magazine comics. Because as you know, he's only in one adventure. And they've already done a figure of that. So... They managed to get the licensing for this, and it's a really nice costume actually. And I'm glad they got the rights for it, and it's really nice. So out of all the ones I got, I think I got some of the best. The only one that, like, couple that I really wanted that I didn't get were the third Doctor and the sixth Doctor. But I can always get more, so um, I'm happy with what I got. So yeah. So now I need the first, second, third, sixth, seventh, and um, ninth Doctors. Okay, so now we move on to the Daleks. Okay, so they're all from different um, eras. This one is the saucer pilot from the um, episode Dalek Invasion of Earth, which is a first Doctor story. Um, as I, I don't really get any classic um, Daleks or figures, to be honest. I've got Eleventh Doctor set, which isn't really in great condition. But this is really nice here. The eye stalk moves perfectly. Um, it's very poseable actually, it's got the saucer dish on the back, it doesn't have any of the power slats, so it's quite basic, sort of a hark forward to the um, new Daleks, and it is, um, it's got a big base, like the new Daleks, so in many ways this is what a new Dalek might look like, or does look like, and it's a really nice figure here, as you can see, black on um, top, and it's got some black power slats as well. So this is a really nice figure, um, I'm glad I got it. So this is an Emperor Guard Dalek. It looks quite a lot the same, only it doesn't have a power dish at the back. And it does have these power slats here. But it does look a lot like the other figure. I have to say, only smaller. And yeah, it's a really good figure this one. 
and it's well detailed and as you can see it's got a much smaller base and then finally we've got the Supreme Dalek personally my favourite in the set um, a nice gold Dalek here before we got all these common gold Daleks today bronze Daleks this is the proper gold Dalek with the black um, the black dome studs things and yeah this is my favourite of the range um, of these three and it's definitely my favourite and hopefully I might be getting some of the Toys R Us ones and the Toys R Us special range so far the second sixth and tenth doctors are out the um, fifth was actually on ebay for some reason I don't know how they got that on ebay but the fifth, seventh and ninth for pre-order and we've seen pictures of the third and the eighth and the first so they'll be coming soon and then there's still the fourth and the eleventh to come so um some I might get a few of them maybe maybe for Christmas um, um but I'm really really happy with these um I might use them in Vault of the Daleks you never know what might happen but they could be using Vault of the Daleks and uh, which will be released 2014 probably late 2014 but um that'd be nice and I'm also thinking about character building special. Also, if you like character building, check out the custom tiles I made, um, which is the video before this one. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Um, very soon, I'll be posting some more videos. See you, see you then. Thanks, guys.